Youthmer began playing football at an early age and he was soon spotted by Santos FC who offered him a contract in 2003, where he was inducted into their youth academy, which has, in the past, produced Brazilian internationals like Cutno, Claudildo, Diego, Eleno and Alex. He also joined the likes of Pepe, Pele and Robinho in starting out his career at the club, nicknamed Pikes. 14. While in the youth academy, Nmer met Paulo Henrique Ganso, becoming good friends in the process. Aged 14, Nmer traveled to Spain to join the Real Madrid youth team, at the time when Real had stars like Ronaldo, Zinedine Zidane, David Beckham, Roberto Carlos and Robinho. 15 2009 Debut season Mer made his professional debut on March 7, 2009. Despite being only 17 years old, he was brought on for the last 30 minutes, in a 2-1 win against Test. 10. The following week he scored his first goal for Santis against Mogi Marim. One month later, on 11 April, Mer scored the decisive goal in a 2-1 win against Palmers in the 2009 Camp Ionato Paulista semi-final first leg. 16. In the final, however, Santos suffered a 4-2 aggregate defeat to the Corinthians. 17. In his first season, Nmer racked up 14 goals in 48 games. 10-2010, Camp Ionato Paulista success The 18-year-old is a magnificent prospect. He is sleek and skillful, able to beat the defender on either side, capable of combining well and full of tricks he can put to productive views in and around the penalty area. South American football journalist Tim Vickery on Mer in 2010. 18 Mer continued his ascendancy in 2010, and, on April 15, 2010, he scored five goals for Santos in an 8-1 round of Guarani in the qualifying stages of the Brazilian Cup. 19. Following the 2010 Camp Ionato Paulista in which Nmer scored 14 goals in 19 games, 14, the club were crowned champions after a 5-5 aggregate win over Santo André in the finals. 20, Nmer was subsequently given the award for the best player in the competition. 21, Nmer's performances for Santos have drawn comparisons to other Brazilians, including Robinho and Brazilian legend Pele. 22 in 2010. Santos rejected a £12 million bid for him from English Premier League team West Ham United, 23, and later an offer from another English club, Chelsea, reported to be in the region of £20 million. 24. Despite Santos' unwillingness to sell and Mer himself insisting I'm focused only on Santos, 25, his agent, Wagner Ribeiro, indicated that Mer's career was elsewhere stating he wants to become the best player in the world, the chances of him doing that while playing in Brazil are zero. 24. Although one year later Nmer admitted, in an interview with the Daily Telegraph, that he had been happy with Chelsea's interest in him as it was a dream of his to play in Europe, while also stating that at the time it had been the right decision to stay in Brazil. 26. On November 30, 2010. Santos sold a 5% share of future transfer fees that he would receive to an investment group, Tercera Estrela Investimentos S.A. Tiza, for our dollar three million five hundred forty nine thousand nine hundred one point five million euros. 27. The previous year, his family had sold a 40% stake in Mer Sporting Rights to the Disis Port Group, who had been a long-term strategic partner of Santos Football Club. 28 Despite his first two seasons being highly successful, having ended the 2010 season with an impressive 42 goals in 60 games, problems had been identified, namely Nmer's apparent taste for diving when tackled, rather than attempting to continue his run, and his attitude. The latter came to the forefront during a match with Atletico Goianiense, on September 15, 2010, when the Santos manager, Dorival Jr., appointed another player to take the penalty awarded for a foul on Nmer. His decision was based on the fact that Nmer had missed a crucial penalty during the Copa do Brasil final of that year, even if Santos went on to win. Reacting to this, Nmer turned his back on his manager, had to be calmed down by a linesman and argued with his captain, Edu Dracina. The fallout from this event was that Dorival Jr. wished to have Nmer suspended for two weeks but the board sided with the player and promptly sacked the manager. Despite Nmer's apologies over the incident, 
Some doubts still remain about his attitude. 10. In December 2010, aged just 18, Nmer came third for the 2010 South American Footballer of the Year, behind Andres D'Alessandro and Juan Sebastian Varin.